Hi everyone, I'm Dave Fleming, and welcome to the Good Tidings Foundation and our 2011 Year in Review. In our 17th year, we continued our commitment to providing underserved youth access to art, education, athletics, and dreams. I'm standing here in front of our Leroy Neiman Art Center for Youth on Pier 9 in San Francisco. It was a big year for our arts program. This spring, many of our board members traveled to New York to bring Leroy gifts from the students to celebrate his 90th birthday. With Leroy's blessing and support, we completed a full remodel of the Leroy Neiman Art Center for Youth over the summer, and the students have been thriving in the new space. We partner with all the Bay Area professional sports franchises to build youth athletic facilities in underserved communities. Earlier this year, we completed four athletic facility construction projects. First, a basketball court at Haight Elementary in Alameda. Next, we renovated one of the most famous street ball courts in the country at Oakland's Mosswood Park, where legends like Bill Russell, Jason Kidd, and Gary Payton were groomed. Rounding out our projects with our partner, the Golden State Warriors, we built a basketball court for the Oakland School's Police After School Program, along with a wiffle ball field we added for the children with the Oakland A's. And we're already underway with several other projects that will be completed in early 2012. In the 13th year of our Community Service Scholarship Program, we will award 20 scholarships to incredible philanthropic high school seniors, totaling $100,000. To date, we've given $889,000 in scholarships to deserving students. We've fulfilled many dreams through our Rockstar Road Trips Program, and since introducing aspiring youth from East Palo Alto to their idol, Carrie Walsh, they are dreaming bigger and reaching higher. In the spirit of the holidays and the original program on which our charity was founded, we will start our 17th consecutive year of distributing holiday toys to children throughout the Bay Area. Funding for each of these programs would not have been possible without the generosity and dedication of our supporters, though we always manage to enjoy ourselves at the Stadium Stampede at AT&T Park, the Pro-Am Golf Tournament at Lake Merced, and the Auction Catalog Launch Party at Mistral Restaurant.
2012 will be highlighted with several new athletic construction projects, including our third Kerry Walsh Court and an inner city baseball academy with the San Francisco Giants. On behalf of all of the Good Tidings board members, I would like to thank all of you for your support of the Good Tidings Foundation over the past 17 years. Thank you!